Welcome back to Let's Play Sweet Coden. When we last left off, we went to the village of the elves and was arrested because uh, Kirkus uh, did something bad. So now we're stuck in here and uh, we got some people in here as well, so let's go talk to them. Oh. Well, if it isn't chicken-hearted Kirkus, who turned and ran when he found out the Imperial Army was attacking. Hey, don't you remember me? Stallion, the fastest pair of feet in the village. Didn't you know? You should have seen how fast I ran when Quanda attacked. <laughs> yeah, you're a jerk. Well, a character, at least. Who the hell are you? Liberation Army? Come to help the elves? I guess we're all fools here. That's an Imperial human uniform. Yep, I was a fool too. I risked my life to betray the Empire, and look at me now. How stubborn these elves are. They refuse to believe what I know. So what is it you know? Oh, that. The man in charge of this region is the great General Quander Roseman. He has commissioned a horrible weapon to exterminate the rebellious elves. Horrible weapon? What is it? I'm not sure, but it's called the Burning Mirror. They say it can burn down an en entire forest in an instant. Not only the elves, but the village where I was born. That's why I came. I wanted to warn the elves of this, of this danger, so they could prevent the Burning Mirror's completion. And before you knew it, you were in this prison. Yeah. Uh, can I get out? Oh. Who is it? Sylvania. Grandpa said I shouldn't come here, but I have to ask. Ask what? Tell me, Kirkus, why are you so hung up on humans? Humans act big. You can get their dead after only 50 years or so. Why bother with such lowly, with such lowly creatures? Dead after only 50 years or so? What an awful thing to say! Listen to me, Sylvania. It's true that humans dislike elves and dwarves. We look down on humans. The dwarves detest us. Isn't it sad? After all, what's the difference between us? Why can't we get along? I just don't understand it. It's very sad. Kirkus, I'm sorry, Kirkus. I don't understand what you're saying. I just can't. I just can't trust humans and dwarves scare me. But, but, I'll believe you. I'll believe whatever you believe me. Whatever you, you believe. I'll do my best to believe. Sylvina. Here's the key to the cell. Do you think I'll end up in here for doing this? Yeah, you never know. Ha! Ah, I, Stallion, shall show you how fast I can run. In incredible. Kirkus, you run too. You can't run that fast, of course. No, I can't run away. I have to do something about that burning mirror that Valeria was talking about. What can you do? I have an idea. Master Danny, northeast of this village is the village of the dwarves. They must know something. Let's get their help. Yeah, I agree. Let's go. Me too. If we don't hurry, there'll be a disaster. We must prevent the burning mirror from being completed. Kirkus, are you going to dwarf country? They say dwarves eat elves. That's just a nasty rumor. We should get rid of the prejudices like that. Let's go, Master Danny. Yeah, let's go. Uh, are you going with us? Damn it, we don't have time to waste around here. Shouldn't have trusted those elves. Okay. Yeah, let's go then. I am uh, 
finished here. Let me just check. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm finished. I even got my uh, white paint. Take me with you, Commander Danny. I want to help protect this forest. Valeria will join. Oh. Um. Sorry, Pawn. Kirkus. Do you want to come along, Sylvania? This time you're welcome to join us. I'll stay. I'll wait for you to come back. So, promise me you'll return. Promise? I promise I'll be back. I'll never make you feel sad again. It's a promise. Oh, That's nice. But now we need to change the formation. And, uh... What am I doing? You should be there and... Yeah, OCD, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, let's check out. Yeah, she doesn't have any equipment. To speak of, at least. Else? <laughs> White paint? No. Necklace, perhaps. Obviously. Uh, yeah. Ooh, a nice pair of shoulder pads. Luckily, I didn't sell stuff. No helmet, though. Well, that'll do. Yeah, we are ready to go to the land of the dwarves. Oh, the village, at least. Nah, I'm gonna fight you right now, at least. But first, we must cross the dwarf trail. Ooh, some nice treasure. Feather. Grimio um, Blue Ribbon Yeah, why not? Nice. Ooh. Dwarf and Eagle Man. They look kinda strong, so um, let's do this classic. <laughs> Falcon Rune. It looks awesome and it's one of the uh, more useful runes in the game actually. And you'll see why. Hopefully. Yeah, 195. Some nice money. Ooh, and a painting! <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, you never know when you might need a painting. Actually, uh, those are very useful items. Show that off that a little bit later. Please go away. Ooh. Okay, you need to stop doing that right now. Thank you. And uh, let's check. Uh, yeah, 
Let's use a Mega Medicine. We're good to go. Doo -doo -doo. Karate uniform. Nice. At least it was useful for one person. Uh, I think we'll go left. Oh, goodness. Just for that, I'm going to use that attack again. As you can see, it's a very good uh, grinding spot, this area. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna do that though, but... Perhaps. No, 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 no! Oh. Okay, you guys annoy me now. But hey, let's heal up first, before I do anything else. That was a bad move. Will we survive? No! Crash. <sighs> oh well. Fur cape. What's that? Ooh, nice. Uh. Give it to Cleo, but I need to uh, <sighs> exit the menu apparently. No, I need to get rid of st some stuff. 102. Well, let's carry on. Yeah, sacrificial Buddha. Uh, that's a Another very useful item. Uh, if you ran out of HP, like Gremio just did, that item will actually heal you automatically uh, and disappear, obviously. So, uh, yeah, I'll keep that in uh, Danny's item, actually. Because you never know. On. Please you go away. No. Nope. Nicely done. Maybe I should grind something. <laughs> it's not going too well. If I do grind, I'll do that off screen. But oh, some. Multiple choices here. Guard robe. I don't think it's no. It's useless. At least in this party. Nah. I don't like you. Killer crystal. I'll probably sell that. That's that's not something I use really. Medicine! Speaking of which, I should heal! No, that wasn't necessary. For once. Hello? Uh, yes. Yeah, sure. Just for that, I'm going to use the deadly fingertips. And. Firestorm. It's good enough, I guess. And you go bye bye. Ooh, nice. Cleo with fire magic is. Excellent.
kicks ass. And another fur cape. Where is it? There it is. Oh, I'm running out of... For items, uh, yeah. Oh my, another one. Fortune room piece. And I need some good luck. Really? Nah. Screw you guys. I'm leaving. Dwarf Stingy! Keep sickness cure a secret, but Kuramimi never give up! That cabal. You! I don't forgive! Grrr, but Kuramimi busy now! What is that? He is a weird fellow. But it was a safe point, I don't want to fight you guys. No, I'll save. If I may. Level 20 and... 21. That's... I don't know, is it good enough? I hope so. But for now, let's head up to... The Dwarf Village. No, Village of the Dwarves, even. Uh, there we go. Yeah, let's, let's go to the inn. Why not? 200 bits. There we go. Actually, just let me check this quickly. Oh, no, nothing. Nothing at all. This is the shop I desperately need to go to. Whose item would you like to appraise? I would like to appraise this part. Hopefully it's something good. Octopus are nice. And this ornament. Hex doll. Figures. And this painting. Graffiti. Uh, ooh, another part. Ooh, lots of stuff. Hex doll, thank you. And a purse. Let's see, octopus urn, 560. And the graffiti. you're here, why not? Uh, shoulder pads, I do not need. Do not need brass armor, I hope. Guard robe, and the killer crystal. Uh, shoulder pads. Actually, I don't need that. I'll get rid of it. For everybody. Right. I hope. Half armor, leather armor. Yeah, let's give you. I'll actually skip those for now. Because I uh, may be uh, tinkering with my uh, weapons a little bit later. Nice. Wrong. Point at. It's no longer needed. Wow. She only had. 
got a headband. What's wrong with me? Really? Pointed hat. Karate uniform. And, uh, that's that. I guess, yes. Do do do. No. No. No one I need to talk to. But yeah. An item shop that we must take a look at. Turtle crystal prevents status anomalies. Yeah, I'll just buy some mega medicine actually. Mars, eh? Okay, if Mars thinks you guys are okay, then you're okay. I'll help you out. Put me in charge of your weapons. Recruit, of course. Alright, I'll go tell the chief of the dwarves that I'll be gone for a while. After that, we'll go to Torrent Castle. And Mies joins! And that means that we can uh, sharpen our weapons to uh, a higher level. Uh, how high? Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, I think it is um, level 7 or something. But for now, let's see. Uh, yeah. Ooh, I only have 5 bits left. And of course, I forget to put the quarter in piece. Look at that, water rupees three. That's beautiful. Because I don't have any memory at all, I have to check my inventory for additional room pieces, but I didn't have any, so let's go and meet this uh, chief that he mentioned. He must be up here. Well, what unusual visitors! Human and elf, hand in hand. What brings you to the dwarf mines? Chief of the dwarves, we come to ask you for a favor. A proud elf asking a lovely dwarf for a favor? Chief, have you ever heard of a burning mirror? Of course I have, it's one of our treasures. Wanda Roseman has gotten hold of a blueprint and is planning to burn down the forest. Ho ho, that's very funny. I hope all the elves are killed. Ho ho. What a thing to say. Besides, do you expect me to believe that one of your sluggish humans really succeeded in stealing a blueprint from us? It's true. A fellow called Cage stole the blueprint. Oh, really? Yeah, remember Cage? He'll do anything for money. Ho oh, oh. ho! You'll have to prove such human competence. You're saying a human can break into, break into our vault? Try it then! Let's give it a try. Ho oh, oh, ho! What fun! Then try to steal the running water route from our vault. If you can do that, I'll believe your story. Our vault is due north from this village. It was way too big to build here. <laughs> I'll show you. Well, uh, perhaps not in this episode, but I'll show you in the next one. Let's head in there at least. The chief has filled us in. This vault can't be opened by a stupid elf. Oh, really? Okay, then. I will end this video. When we come back, we will enter the vault. See you next time.